I'm seriously th still thinking about using the Danger Daisy strat now. It might be kind of annoying listening to the Danger music, but we can always throw on a HP plus if we change our mi change our minds and go to 10. I think it might be kind of fun. It could bite us though, especially like with just normal enemy encounters, we could end up going through a lot of life shrooms. So we need to find Gold Bob. Oh no, there he spawned. Good thing we have Chill Out. I tried to spare you, Piranha Plant, but you just had to keep coming after me. So we're going to... You know we don't really need FP quite yet. We can wait. I tried to spare him. He really wanted to fight. I just can't get over how much damage that is. Ah! Oh. <laughs> Guess we got another one. Still nowhere near a level. left on the control pad but it didn't go right away. There we go. Death by Yoshi is the newest fan in Paper Daisy. It's just so good. It's so good. So all we have left to, to level is Vivian and Mouse. So we'll level Vivian now, since we're back in Rogueport anyway. Um, and then... So we're gonna see... How do I get to... Oh, God, I, I just passed it. Oh wait, no, that's not right. I was thinking there was a house back there. I'm trying to find the just the normal fortune teller. Uh, or not the normal one, the one that tells you where this... The, uh... Shine sprites are. Maybe she's just in the main area. Oh, maybe she's... yeah, maybe she's in here. I think there's a panel here. I think that's what Miss Mouse is sniffing, because I was hitting it with the golf club thinking it would flip. But obviously that wasn't the case. Gotta be. No! I know I said I was going to let this go, but clearly I haven't yet. 
I think it's, I think it's on the rooftop up there. Cause remember, I search. Yeah, I went across with Yoshi, and there's nothing there. And then I tried to search for panels with the golf club. When I should have been. It's been jumping. Okay, I was wrong again. Dang it. Where is that? Anyway, I'm pretty sure the fortune teller's in here. I just remembered. Don't tell me it's here. Okay. I welcome Daisy. I'm more lovely, the f lovely fortune teller. Seeing with my amazing abilities, that which you should seek is my humble job. Light of the shining stars will light that which I wish to see. Aha! So, shall I see something for you? Shine sprites. We have the money. Focus, focus, focus. Abracadabra, hullaboo. Uh, more magic words. Aha, star, show me what I seek. I see a shine sprite. On Rogueport's east side, it is in the back room of the sea bomb's house. I completely missed that one. Let's see if we can find any more. Hopefully we don't just hear the same one. The dense, eerie woods behind a tree beyond the big rock. Oh, we missed that. The dense, eerie woods. Which woods? After Twilight Town or Bogley Woods? Behind a tree beyond the big rock. Sounds like Bogley Woods. Well, no, there's a, there was a big rock in after Twilight Town, too. Okay, so there should be one more in the game. Okay. And then it looks like the next one is out of reach for now. Huh. Yeah, I still don't- I'm not sure which woods they're talking about. Well, I'm gonna give up on that mystery item for now here. Get back on track. So... Yeah, this is probably a bad idea, but it might be fun, so we're gonna do it. And hopefully we can actually find some more close call badges and just keep stacking them. And then we can put in all the pretty luckies too. Uh, who needs adjustment? Me. Up which level? BP. Down HP. Yes. We'll see if this works or not. It's a good idea for bosses, but probably a bad idea for normal encounters. But that being said, as long as we're smart about normal encounters, I think we'll be fine. You know, we have stopwatches, we have clock outs, like we have Peril Yoshi. <laughs> this could work. What is BP cap at? Is, is it uh, 99 in this game? AKA, we probably won't even reach the cap. 
And if we keep our partner's HP up, then ideally... Um, ideally, Daisy gets missed. She'll either have Shell Shield, she'll, she'll have Shell Shield on, we can use Dodgy Frog, we can use a lot of stuff. Blue Sheets. And then we just keep our partner alive so they don't end up using up our life shrooms by way of our 3 HP plus P's. Uh, I just hope that the, H the danger sound isn't going to be too much. That being said, there might be a mod out there to remove the beeping noise, but we'll see. But if it drives you guys nuts, let me know and I'll just... Oh wait, we can only go to 10. Maybe that's the original that you can go to 5. But I got another idea. Oh wait, no. Oh, I'm bad. <laughs> this is what we increase. Okay, we can go to 5. Never mind. We're fine. If we wanted to, we could just go under the chomp water four times and then then we'd have Peril Daisy. Which we may as well have Peril Daisy. But again, it might be kind of annoying to listen to. Then we could have Mega Rush P or Yeah. We could have a uh, Mega Rush on. And then Daisy can do ridiculous damage now too. I mean, if we're at five, we might as well be at one, right? <laughs> and as long as they don't get a turn and we have chill out on, they won't get a turn. So I could just do this now. Daisy. And everything from the power, from power rush, close call, all that is going to be on. I wonder if we could get another mega rush. I think I passed one up earlier, which is stupid. Um, so the pretty luckies will stack. Twelve here. Uh, PFD down. We might as well have this on in our situation. And then I'd like to equip two of these, but I don't think we have enough to do that yet. Flower saver P. Uh, that I'd be willing to take off. So fire drive would be pretty nuts right now. But power bounce would be good for bosses. But they're both three either way, you could interchange those. Otherwise, Quake Hammer would be great. Would be a good nuke attack for Daisy here. You probably have to have several.
Ideally, I have Fire Drive and Quake, like both of them. And then multi bounce. You lower FP for now, too. Power plus P is pretty expensive, so we could take that off in favor of defense plus P. Keep in mind, this is 5 HP per partner. Multi-bounce is going to be really good here for, fly or for aerial enemies. Thank you. Hammer throw might be nice for hitting certain enemies that are like electrified and such. Again, just having options is, is really nice. We don't really need super appeal. Chill out should stay on with our current situation. Shield so is pretty costly at three. One left over. Do ice power. Or maybe charge P. I don't think we really need to charge with this setup though. Should be nuts. Vivian. And we actually need to go back in the sewers um, to get a shortcut to find Gold Bob. I wish I knew where that shine sprite was exactly. Before we do any of that, I want to double check, see if there's any more Mega Rush peas or Power Rush peas. Like the Bad Shop as well. Well, we could double up fire drive. I think that would be too costly for BP though. Two requires more FP for the move but increases the attack power. Not sure that's a great investment. We're, doing, we're already doing so much more damage right now. I'd rather put more B. I'd rather put the BP into just increasing attack or defenses and uh, keeping versatility variety. So close to another level too. Finally, Vivian's turn. It would be nice to get Mouse powered up too, but if we don't, we don't. Oh, I thought we had three. Okay. 
And that's right, there, so we know there's a shrine right at Bobbery's house, so now we just have to figure out where in... It's either Bogley Woods? You know, we could probably find that other shine sprite with all the backtracking that we're going to be doing. Trying to... Oh, that scared me for a sec. Um, trying to get General White. So let's go to Bobberies. Oh no, it's to the left here. I miss this shine sprite. Ah, <laughs> oh. I miss. It's fine. We got it now. That's what matters. <clears throat> All right. Oh, we have the shortcuts now. And on the way, we can. Test our new strats. Kind of see where our power level is at. Then every time we hit rope port, we should check the shops, make sure that. See if there's a uh, Mega Rush, another Mega Rush available somewhere. I don't know if there's only one or not. I, I vaguely remember selling one. It was not smart in retrospect. I think I need to go. I forget what the fastest way to the shortcut is. Let's just go down. Yeah, Poshley Heights should be all the way to the left here. Gold Bob should be by the station. Looks like I missed something here. Star panel? Oh no, it's that end coupon. Yeah, pretty sure. Yep, it was in coupon. That is not treasure mouse, that is trash. Ah, uh, looks like, okay, they're all missing five HP. This is the badge. Good day to see you, Bonita. What can I do for you today? What's that you say? You must use the cannon in Far Outpost to save the world? Hmm. Well, that is rather a pickle, isn't it? Very well, then. I certainly owe you a favor or two, hmm? Yes, I should say. The truth is, I had hoped to resume my business with that cannon someday. And just between us, I only stopped because the wife said she didn't like the noise. Sadly, it takes a hefty bit of coin to get that cannon working, so... I need you to demonstrate just how much you want to use that cannon. If it were a matter of money, just how much would you pay, if I may ask? Everything I have. Why do you pay every coin you own? All of them? You were, uh, really? So, really? Yes. Well, I suppose I'm just surprised to hear you say that. Staggered, actually. You know that means you'll be left with zero coins. Absolutely nothing. Yeah, we're kind of used to that. I mean, think of it. Think of it, gal. All your, if you spent all your coins, I mean all of them, you would be certainly face a great deal, you would certainly face a great deal of difficulty down the road. Yes. Hold on, I want to make sure you're doing this fully aware of the consequences. Are you sure you won't regret this later? Absolutely sure. Yes. I can really take them all. Really? 
You won't say just kidding later on or any sort of tomfoolery like that. Yes. All right then. Oh, we're broke again. Hmm. Well, you've you certainly showed me something, ma'am. So I give my permission for you to activate the fire outpost cannon. Got a gold bob guide. Old Bob's user's manual for the Far Outpost Cannon. Oh, and I wasn't serious earlier, my dear fellow. How can I take your money? Ha 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 shame, I suppose. But I'll return your money. Oh, good. Now, soldier on, my, my gal. So do we go back to a far outpost now? Yeah, I guess so. Oh, are they in the bottom new spawns? Okay. I go back to Far Outpost. Hopefully I'm correct. Alright, am I gonna level here? Not a chance. Alright, let's see what Peril Daisy can do. What should we hit these guys with? Quick hammer? So that pierces defenses. Which means our base, I think, is 10. Alright, so that's going to be the problem. <laughs> oh, goodbye life shroom. That sucks. <laughs> so we're pretty much going to be saving our coins for life shrooms at this point. I mean, did you see that damage though? It still might be worth the risk. And we can get back pretty easily. We can buy four life streams with our coins right now. And we could just buy some and then stock stock up on some. Yeah, let's see. Let's see what else she can do. Yeah, cuz she's got so we got P up, D down. Um get rid of this guy first. talk after the fight. Look at how much we just got. That was 28 damage. The only issue I'm seeing is just enemies dropping hearts and us accidentally running into them, but... Even if that happens, we'll still at least be in danger and still do good damage and then still have two close calls activated. Because we still would have we still would have power rush. Eh, I mean it's fun. Eighty-five. Yeah. The other, the other thing is when we level up, we will be back to five, but I mean, it's not that bad. We're in danger, like, that's still fine. Yeah, we'll play around a little bit more. So I want to see where we're at.
So that does 10. Alright, we're just gonna switch out Yoshi here. Gonna get us a lot. It's just like stuff that's fall, stuff that falls and and whatnot. I don't know if maybe enough defense pluses will protect us there. I don't really know. Right, what other thing? Let's see how much fire drive does. 13? <laughs> oh my god. Okay. Yeah, we can't collect the hearts for the partners anymore either. I mean, we could. It's not that big a deal if we are out of peril. We're gonna be out of peril anyway. With, any with every level up. That's just so much damage. <laughs> Alright, well we're gonna level up anyway. Might as well heal Bobbery here. I just wanted to see some of the numbers there. We're at 97, we should just level. Um... We're going to. We gotta get that. We gotta get some life shrooms too. I have a feeling we're gonna go through these through these a lot faster now, so gonna have some stored and then just buy as many as we can here. There we go. And we're broke again. Might be bad, but we can always sell badges. Before we go back to Far Outpost, I just want to check to see if Bad Shop has anything. Hoping to find another Mega Rush. Actually, I could check to see if we can buy something back here. I sold one. Kind of regretting selling Tornado Jump. That might actually be really good with, with um, Harold Daisy. Dang it. I wouldn't mind having that one back, but it's not like a huge deal. Shrink some, but we're not going to use it to set up. That's some coins. What all? 
Tools. Tempted to sell zap tap. I I just don't see us using it. Yeah, we're gonna sell zap tap. We can always buy them back. I think I'm gonna. I think I'll buy back tornado jump. 160 right now, so I'll sell 60 left. It's 2 BP. I think we get rid of hammer through a multi bounce run tornado jump. Power Slayer P, I, I, again, I'd be willing to take that one off. Just to have more options. Again here. All right. <clears throat> okay, hopefully I'm doing this right. Back we go. We are gonna level up here. She still does a lot of damage, even with just in danger. It's still 16 damage, and the enemy does have one defense. on BP. Daisy became an A-list star. Next battle, Daisy's crowd on stage will get even bigger. Fantastic. I like one power bounce on too. You know, a spring jump is really good though.
Power bombs for bosses at the very least. Well, my partners are already doing like a, ri a ridiculous amount of damage anyway. I think I do this and this. That makes sense to me. So we'll go... Yeah, who am I kidding? We'll do power bombs. Not like we have to have Daisy at one at, at all times, but I could set it up again. There's Peril. And Yoshi Nuke. paper now. So, you have got permission of Gold Bob. So now we need General White. I hear you were seen in Petalburg. You head there. Dude, we just got here. What? <laughs> So it begins. Hmm. So it begins. Yeah, the backtracking. But at least we can grab that mist, uh, the mist shine sprite now. I just feel like if we had to play the you are dead a while back, missed opportunity. Well, hopefully we don't get another opportunity. Oh man, this is a perfect fire drive moment. Yoshi does more damage, though. Yeah, plus we got the FP reducer for Yoshi. We're gonna go through a lot of FP with this with this strat here. Yeah, we're already at five. I shouldn't have used fire drive. I'm getting a little mad with power, I gotta calm down.
But if we just use if we just open up the sweet tree, then we get seven back, and then we just use Yoshi. It'll just take a little longer. I don't think there's a shortcut for it because it's already in the sewers. Don't know, safety save. that game. Order is good though. to deal with weak enemies. Nah. I don't actually remember where to get the bump attack badge. It's a shame too, that would be really nice to gain uh, some more FP back with. Maybe there is a shortcut to Pelberg. No, I actually don't remember. I saw that they have a different animation style too. Is it uh is it snow days? Forget who we talked to. What's that you say? General White? Hmm, General, hmm, well I've... I'm certain I've seen him around, but not lately, no. I think he may have possibly said he might head south to a more tropical locale. Creaky Key? Was that it? Yep, that's it. That might be, possibly, perhaps, could be it. Oh boy. Yeah, the, the 3D style. I am a huge South Park fan, don't get me wrong. I just haven't gotten around to the games yet. I have Stick of Truth. I, I have not... I've played it, I haven't beaten it yet. Too many games, not enough time. Wait, uh, not Bogley Woods. I want to kill Hall Key. Should be here. A day may come when we forsake our friends and break all bonds of fellowship. Whoa! But it is not this day. An hour of wolves 
and shattered shields when the age of men comes Markar's rated of 13. This day. This day we Welcome fight. Raiders. Shout out to Markar's. Uh, this is Paper Mario T2ID Insane Mode. Let me pull up the rules for you guys. Going well. Um, so yeah, this is basically just a vanilla game, but with difficulty modifiers and obviously character modifier. So all enemies have double health. They deal double damage. They have one extra defense. And we have the double pain badge equipped, so Daisy actually takes quadruple damage. Yeah. And uh, we actually just change our setup. So we're doing some peril strats here. So it's been pretty crazy. So here's the badges we have on right now. So, Power Rush, Mech Rush, stacking close calls, and pretty luckies. And then, abusing quick change. We did pretty well against the last boss. Then items, life shrooms, boost sheets, maple syrup, stopwatch, point swaps, and wackus bumps. But with Daisy at 1 HP now, it, we're being extra cautious. But we kind of figured that we were getting one shot by bosses anyway, so we might as well just get rid of our HP in favor of BP. We are pretty far. We are going to the moon, but unfortunately, this is the most boring part because we're searching for General White. General White? Yeah, he was here until a second ago. But he took off right quick. Said he was going to an arena or something. Yes, chapter seven. Alright, looks like we have to go all the way to Glitz Pit. Yay! I forgot it, take you, it took you to Glitz Pit, too, and I don't think there's a great shortcut there. Yep, we made it to 60 in Pit. So we're doing Glass Cannon strats, essentially. So right now... I just realized, yeah, we can't really get... So right now, wait, I'm gonna use Sweet Treat. We're gonna swap out a Yoshi so he doesn't accidentally get healed. If I end up healing Daisy accidentally, oh well. I'll try not to. But even if she's in danger, it's still gonna be good for us. Not the best, but... This is the power of peril strats right here. See, part of the stage is falling. And they all have plus one defense, too. And I'm pretty sure, yep, we got all of our HP back. So I actually can't grab those without healing Daisy. Go ahead and switch to somebody else for now. But even if Daisy's in danger, I mean, we still get all the close call buffs and we still get power plus. So it's not that big a deal if Daisy gets out of peril. Um. So yeah, let's go back up. But 
But otherwise, for you guys coming in, my name is Pure Sage. I am a challenge runner. We do a lot of randomizers, mostly because I'm addicted to them. But we have a lot of uh, self-inflicted challenges that we created, and then um, we just play hard games as well. But mostly, we do a lot of suitor, actually. Let's go... Let's pit. I'm sure General White will be here. But yeah, we did do 50, uh, 60 layers of pit. Reason being, we wanted to get the strange sack item that doubles our item inventory. Items are huge in this challenge. And we do plan to clear out Pit of Honored Trials after getting the last Crystal Star. Just because it feels like the right thing to do here. Challenge Run felt like the right thing to raid from Dark Souls. Ah! That makes sense. I mean, my... My, uh... My follower noise is actually from Dark Souls. So, you can... You can bet that we're gonna play the Souls series at some point. Um, I'm not sure where to ask about General White here. Let's go inside. I played I played Dark Souls like quite a few times and beaten it. But there's a lot of the Souls series I haven't finished yet. Uh welcome to the Glitz Plate. There's a guy over there who gets paid to say that, right? If he doesn't feel the same, it's gonna get weird here, but I have to tell him. Sigh. I just wish I was think I just I sigh just thinking about him. I think we talked to these guys? I forget who you talked to here about General White. Maybe it was... Maybe it was in the... Ah, it's been so long. I'm doing my first playthrough of the whole series right now. Nice. The very first playthrough. Not here. Oh, you just finished Dark Souls 1. Nice. And that was your first game in the series. Okay. It's definitely not the easiest one. Yeah, well done on that then. I don't think I should have went inside. I think I gotta talk to someone outside. Yoshi here. I have not played Dark Souls 3 yet. I haven't, actually I haven't, I've played a decent amount of the From Soft Tiles that I haven't beaten a lot of them yet. Perhaps the juice bar? Ah, there it is. General White. Oh, you mean that white bob -omb, huh? Yeah, he used to come here all the time. But I haven't seen him lately. Now that I think about it, I think he headed off to some huge tree. Or not. Ah, yes. So we're missing a one shine sprite. And it's either in Bogley Woods or in um, past Twilight Town. We're not sure which one. 
So I figured since we're backtracking to find General White anyway, we might as well have Mouse and just kind of search around. I wouldn't be surprised if Dark Souls 3 is harder than 1. Safety save again. Hey, at least this challenge is in permadeath. This game is too long for that. Your sage rage stream. We're not raging quite yet. Woods. I'm hoping when they have the remake for this game, they'll speed up this uh, segment here. Not really sure how to do it. With... I'm not sure how they do it while still trying to stay faithful, but I'm sure they can figure out a way. Welcome to the Great Tree. Eh? General White? Yeah, he's an old bob with this great mustache. But I have no idea where he went. He may have said he was going somewhere dark. Before we go to the next place, I'm curious to see which shine sprite I missed. So it said something about a big rock and a tree. And I don't... I'm not sure which area it is. We might get lucky and find an Amazing Daisy too. With our firepower right now, we could probably kill one, even at double health and plus one defense. I don't think it's I don't think it's Bogley Woods that I miss. I think it's because there's a giant rock. I know there's a giant rock in the other place. Let's check there first. I don't think there's a giant rock in Bogley Woods. So, go west here. Even if they added just more shortcuts would be cool. Uh, so we need to go up and fall back down. to take care of my post stream stuff. I understand that completely. I do that myself. <laughs> Thank you for the raid, Markars, and everyone, be sure to follow Markars too. He's pretty awesome. And I learned a lot of awesome Zelda stuff from him.
Where am I going? I went to Far Outpost. I need to go to Twilight Town. We'll check on General White and then we can see if we'll see if we can find that shine sprite too. Uh, I bet we yeah, we'll probably talk to the mayor. I might as well search for star pieces while we're here too. Is there a panel here? That's some item. Probably something in one of these bushes I missed. some sort of item here. Could be on the inside too. Uh, hey, it's the savior of our town. It's Daisy! Ever since that pig business, we're on constant guard. But I don't think for a second, but don't think for a second that we forgot about you. Uh, Okay. I thought he would tell us about General White. I suppose not. Oh. That's gotta be it. Yep. Oh. I, didn't, I don't remember that star piece back there. We already talked to you. General White? Yeah, I know that old guy. He's a white bobum, right? He was here until recently. What? Where did he go? What am I? His, his secretary? He looked tired. I know that. He looked tired. Does that mean he went back to his bed? I just thought of something else. We have Rallywink with Goombella. So we could actually have two turns of Peril Daisy. I don't know if that's a game changer, but something to think about. Because then you could keep Goombella at what? She has got 40 HP now with the two HP pluses. They were two HP plus Ps. Let's find Yoshi here. Oh, actually, we'll keep Mouse out because trying to get all the treasures here. There's more? Oh, where? Perhaps in one of the houses? The screen isn't fixed. What do you mean? Is it on be right, be right back still? Like it did the same thing to you as it, as it did to Cloud earlier. Oh, well, there's the start piece. Wow, two start pieces I missed. You're playing the game in the corner. That's not good. Oh, I missed all sorts of stuff. Okay. 
Okay. Horn block. Oops. Twenty two damage. Should be able to just beat him with jumps, right? Oh yeah. Flower Finder will actually put us ahead here. Twitch glitch indeed. I imagine you can reload it, right? And it'll fix it. What I usually do. Nothing on the screen. If we get really lucky, we'll find an amazing daisy on the way. How cool would that be? Yeah, it's now results the slash shine spray. We can upgrade mouse. Which, she's pretty much just gonna be a, sh a shield. But she could still come in handy for stealing some pretty rare badges later. Look at all the star power we're getting. Yeah, so if I wanted to, I could use Rally Wing for three. Three to give Daisy an extra turn if I wanted to. Um, actually, I can't kill. You know, I might as well. It's actually really easy to do. Alright, so how much does a normal hammer do? Hopefully, this kills. Did not kill. Well, fortunately, they charged up. Oops. Darn, miss all the flowers. Mouse should kill. Nah, I'll use Vivian. I think this kills. Yeah. No, you definitely don't want to catch her on a bad day. It's a little annoying having to like dodge the hearts, but it'll be worth it if you run into an amazing daisy.
And since we're going to have to go all the way back, we might as well just clear out the enemies. Maybe we'll get lucky and find one. Uh, we can do Quake. Yeah. Overkill. So much damage. Oh, I didn't see that heart there. Oh, that is unfortunate. That hit Yoshi too. Uh, that's not ideal. I don't remember the last time I saved either. The heart must have been behind something. Because I did not see that heart. So I think this is the big rock here. Then Miss Mouse is detecting something. Yeah, we did the unthinkable. We healed Yoshi. And ourselves. But it's okay, I got an idea. back here. Oops. Oh well. We weren't in peril anyway. We only need a peril Yoshi right now. He's back! Ah, switch! Okay. And there it is. We try for one more Maisy Daisy? No, oh, no, that's all of them. I guess we had another chance. Should have let them hit. Oh no, they would have killed me. Ah, 
Poppy's gonna have 50. gonna fall. Get one Amazy Daisy. Although with Daisy not in peril anymore, I don't know if we'll actually find one. I think this is the last chance. Nope. Can get Daisy back into danger though. Right back into peril, I should say. Yeah, we'll just stop time. I wanna get rid of this guy. Kills him in one? Tempting. That's not good. That's why we have the close calls on. Alright, can I get rid of you? I gotta get Flurry out of there. Either way their turn is used up, but that's that's fine. I just have a danger daisy. Live stream here. I can try clock out again and just hope it works. Otherwise, I could try art attack. Hmm. Yeah, I'm not sure what the move is here. I don't know if art attack would kill 14. Could just run away and not have to deal with all this, but this is actually good practice for me to deal with all this. Look at all those star power we're getting back. And this is how we get Daisy back to one. It's 
28 damage and shrunk. What the heck? Alright, now we got it back, back to looking out for hearts. I think if I just let everything drop and then look at it, I won't accidentally hit a heart. Cool, now we can upgrade mouse. And then we'll go to Far Outpost. Oops. I'm kind of thinking the bump attack badge is, is in Pit of 100 Trials, but I don't know for sure. But it would be really nice for stuff like this. Yeah, in any case. I don't think I used any of my items, right? No, we're good. Probably should have used a boost sheet earlier now that I think about it. Clearly, attempting that super guard was the better strat. But only because we got it. Sixty-two coins, pretty good. Um, yeah, let's upgrade it and then we'll go. We probably don't need upgraded mouse right now, but might as well. Oh, wrong way. Shall be back. My phone is hot. Sounds good, songs. I never got that star piece? I thought I got that. <laughs> That's funny. And we're gonna check out the bad shops again, just in case. Jump man. I'm not sure if the badge, badge shop can actually carry close calls, or extra close calls, or extra the badges that I want, but it would be nice. Pretty lucky P, damage dodge P, no. No thank you. That's true. I'm gonna have to, I'm gonna have to add that after we beat it. Add that to the list. You're already at 35k though. Not too bad. I thought you were more. I thought you would be more at like 25. Okay, let's upgrade mouse. Honestly, the scariest one, and I probably shouldn't be saying this, but the scariest one that I think someone's gonna redeem is gonna be the combo rando, Rock Green Time and Dora's Mask, because as you've seen from the ones that we have done, it can get ridiculous. And then when you get to entrance rando stuff, like it can just get mean. But fortunately, nobody, uh, nobody, none of my viewers are that mean, and surely not would not subject me to a combo rando that has entrance rando. <clears throat> not into MM that much. I would like to try out the uh, Super Metroid and 
Link to the Past Rando at some point, but I still have to learn Super Metroid. I've beaten it once, but I'm still working on like 100%ing it, and then I gotta work on the randomizer, and then I gotta work on the combo rando. So that's that one's gonna take a long time. <clears throat> but in any case, um, all right, we're going to the outpost now. What did Mouse get? Uh, isn't it like Smooch or something? Yeah. It's not gonna come in handy, especially for 10 FP. Not with our setup. But she has more hit points now. It looks really hard. Yeah, I'm not in a rush to learn that one. That's gonna be something I just... It's one of the goals I'm gonna set for myself. There's just so many well-hidden secrets in Super Metroid, it's just so ridiculous. And then just the difficulty of the two games as well. Yoshi, get off. We got this, right? No, we did not. All right, Yoshi, you know what to do. Kind of regretting taking that FP plus off. It's just so low now. Well, I could just use a maple syrup and buy another one at the shop up here. Stopwatches too. Grab two of these. Just saves so much more time than having to sweet treat and then trying to dodge all the hearts or all the daisy hearts now. Okay, so General White should be here now. If I did this right, yes, okay. That didn't take as long as I remembered. Probably because I so kind of sort of know where to go. Still sound asleep. Try again. He's definitely still asleep. Try again. He's still sawing logs. He couldn't be more asleep. He's counting sheep. He woke. Nah, still asleep. Sleeping like a stash baby. Not even budging. He's still snoring away. Gah, Norf, Snorf, Norf. Now who are you? I'm tired. I do not need your attention. I just want to sleep. 
as it is all hopeless. What? That crown, that dress, and that golf club. A tut, I have been looking everywhere for you. Why? Well, to bring that cannon back online. I had lost my life's work, my very reason to live. I found myself at wit's end, and then the rogue port fortune teller told me, seek the gal with the with the crown, the one with the club and uh, bangs. You will, f she will fulfill your dreams or something like that. What? You need to use the cannon to help you save the entire world. Hip hip hooray! That fortune teller was right. So what are we waiting for? I shall get the cannon ready. So go tell the mayor. Now get moving, hot hot. Whew, finally on our way. Jeez. So cannon is back online. Well, it could just explode with the light. Now let us shoot you guys to the moon. Yeah, we did it, Benita. Now you follow me. You come this way. I haven't been with Gumbella for a bit. Safety save again. Preparations are complete. The cannon is fire ready. Hut, let's do this. Now you stand here. General White, is big bomb cannon ready? Hut, leave it to me. Now men, you know the drill. Low the big bomb cannon. Now, positions everyone. Bring guidance system online. Bringing system online. System now online. System check. System check. All clear. Prepare for detonation sequence. This, I think, is really creative. Coming up. Open outer hatch. Open inner shutter. Elevate on my mark. No, oh, same here, Sage. Two Sages. Sighting. Target is the moon. Direction, 75.38. Elevation, 54.66. Range, 389,603. The remake that you guys should all buy, by the way. I have no shame in saying that. Please buy the remake. Wind speed, 1.08. Correct direction, 3.03. .03. Correct elevation, negative 2.39. Target locked. Chamber hatch open. Now, everyone in. I love I love this cuz of course it's just a whole bunch of bombs. This still looks really good even after all this time. This game is close to 20 years old. Unbelievable. 
Closed chamber hatch. It's crowded in here, Boom. Stop pushing, Bazoom. Ow, ow, ow! You're on my foot, Baboom! It's tight in here, Plume. I'm getting nervous. Stop breathing on my neck! Conditions all green. Stand by. Okay! It is time! Big bomb cannon, fire! Welcome back, sons. Yahoo! Yeah, yeah, yeah! That was so awesome! Good luck, Daisy. That is a fantastic scene. Yeek! You're confused? About what exactly? Wow, that was killer! I totally never would have guessed I'd get to do that! The bomb stuff? The bomb bombs have, have a secret cannon that they don't talk about. And they just use that cannon to fire us to the moon. Well, so yeah, here we are. We're totally on the moon. Because that's how that works. So let's get going, Daisy. Find the last crystal star and save the princess. We've made it to the moon. Where we are quite slow. Mouse is detecting secrets. I don't remember if there's still star pieces on the moon. I'm going to assume there is. It'd be cool to get them all. I don't know if we'll actually go for 100% or not. I think it depends on how close we are. But if I don't end up doing it on stream, I could always just like do it off stream and then record and just like make an edit of the ones I missed. Oh, well, safety saved at the very least. So I know mouse points in the direction. And I know they like hiding stuff behind rocks in this game. It might be that one that's that I didn't explode yet. That cracked rock over there. Gonna turn around? Yeah, I bet it's that cracked rock. I'm so slow. But at least we can jump high. Well, I'm kind of filled up on gear right now. that. I don't know if we'll be able to get that easily again, but we can buy those. Alright, so we are saved. Gulp or Quake Hammer? Quake Hammer is definitely the right play. Oh, I 
mean, at least it didn't hit Daisy. And I guess we'll use Mouse. She's out. This rock as well. There's the vault shroom. How did they get on the moon? Oh, oh, you missed the cutscene. Okay. We. What was that? <laughs> With all these stage hazards, I just can't really see us making uh, Harold Daisy work very well. This may have been a mistake. Or Danger Daisy, that is. Might as well grab this now. <laughs> Glad I brought... I bought extra life shrooms and stored them. Should at least be able to access our inventory. Um, yeah, so the the bob bombs fired us with their cannon is a whole thing. And we went to the moon. Oh, that was lucky. I was not prepared for that. But... So much damage. These guys are only worth three, huh? They should still kill. Time that correctly. set up my Danger Daisy a little bit better here. Okay, so I can dodge the Sage Hazards with close calls. Maybe we're okay. Not an asset approved. No, it was not. That's probably why they're so hush hush about it. Eighty-nine. Okay, so we'll have ninety-five, so we can end with Yoshi safely. That'll be fine. We're so slow. We're so slow. What? 
Oh, yeah, we definitely can't use Pearl Daisy anymore. The Sage Hazards just keep tripping me up. I'll take that boost sheet, though. Oh, we have no space for it. So this will be a level. We'll leave Flurry out here. She can regain some HP. I think we only bring in Peril Daisy for boss fights. She's just gonna We're just gonna eat up too many life shrooms on normal fights if we use her. We're gonna get some more FP here. We're plowing through it. Use gulp there. She's protecting the coins that were scattered. We have chill out on, so that's fine if they hit us. about this encounter. What is there to think about? Just use the win button. There's nothing to think about. Always way over there. Unfortunately, they're so far... Oh, I thought I was gonna get hit again. Unfortunately, they're so far away. I'm not gonna be able to collect the FP items. Nuke! Not quite. Couple. 
actually gonna use Gulp here. That'll save some FP. Uh, excuse me? That's odd. Should be feasible. Six, nine, twelve, just one more. There it is. Secret items here. Here's so. Behind the rock, perhaps? No. Ah, it's gotta be this one. gonna leave you guys but you leave me no choice now probably use a maple syrup too We'll take that. Probably just the coins. Okay, cool. 22k? That's pretty good. My chat is quite wise tonight. Building smells suspicious. Let's be careful, dearie. Who's that, dude? Whoa! That's Daisy! So, let's get him? Get her? Uh-oh, two super shrooms. Whatever will we do? And they're dead. Bonita, don't you think you should heal me? Don't you think that since these x not dopes are running around here? Yeah, totally. It means that the Crystal Star must be here too. So Peach must definitely be here too. We gotta go find her, Bonita.